Hey there, let's take a look at a throwback. This is called Hotel High Dive. Hey there everybody and thank you for visiting Ad Shot. If this is your first time or you are returning, we appreciate you viewing. All video and music made from scratch. Alright and welcome back. This video will be one for the ages. There was a time when I used to seek out thrilling and exciting things and rivers, water, cliff jumping, all sorts of stuff always lured me in no matter what age I was. There's just something about the feeling of a brief moment of flight no matter how you achieve it. In my case jumping off of a high cliff of any kind or some other structure is something that I used to find thrilling and still do but this one was something that I had to size up it's the last video of me alive so here we have a beach resort hotel that's located right on the ocean and they happen to build their swimming pool within feet of the actual structure so when I eyeballed this thing I knew it could be done I've done stuff like this in the past and there you go, you've seen the Hotel High Dive now. And so what I want to do in this video is actually break this down and show slow-mo so you don't have to fiddle with the controls. I can tell you exactly what was going through my mind and what happened and how I achieved this. So it might be fun. So here we go as I'm uh, swimming out of the pool. I've got a lot of comments on the original video that were just hilarious. Just like everyone thought it was fake or CGI or something. And this was again posted 13 years ago. So, I mean, this is the rush you get when you get out of a pool and your heart's still pumping and, you know, you just casually walk over to grab a towel and then head out of the place immediately. So, I actually was a hotel guest here. And I've stayed at this resort as long as I can remember. I remember sitting in the hot tub, which you can just barely see in the background, and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I was the only one on the pool deck, a massive splash like this one happened in the pool. I was looking around as I was sitting in the hot tub alone as like a, you know, eight-year-old kid and I was just blown away by what the heck just happened. And I believe that I was witness to that when I was a kid and so coming back to this hotel as an adult and doing all the crazy things that I had done along rivers, diving into shallow, tiny pools, you know, very calculated of course, sometimes I swim down and and see how deep it actually is before attempting anything like this. But you know, it's clearly marked on the pool. This pool was nine feet deep. Okay, there's there's several things that I'm doing here as I'm walking up to the railing and uh, pacing back and forth and just plotting every little thing that can go wrong. And the moment you hit the water, you arch your back, you expand yourself out as if you were skydiving and slowing yourself down. You have to instantly create drag so that you do not plunge deep into the pool. I'm so used to doing this that this is the reason why I looked at this and it just looked like candy to me. Just like a perfect setup. So this is an amazing event. I just wanted to show you this day. This was really cool. Again, the thrill that you get coming out of the water and the heart pumping action that uh, is happening after you do something that just riles your adrenaline. And so let's take another look as we, you know, plunge off of this thing in real speed. It's really clean. The dive is clean. Everything about it. It's like when I look back at this and now we can slow it down a little more. You can see how I'm moving my arms in the air only for balance. On one of the jumps, I'm extending the arm straight out. There it is. A little wave of the arms and then backwards to gain some you know, flight direction. I mean, there's definitely some steering going on in the air by me throwing my arms in different directions. The moment I think I have it right, the hands come out in front of the head, I make two fists, and I plunge through the water hard. This may not be the thing to do on anything higher than this, but I know at this pace and at these typical jumps, I can plunge through the water with my fists, and I break the, break the water, tuck the head, it's basically an Olympic dive. Now you see that my legs are spread out because I'm gonna try and create drag that has no problem with me. The moment I hit the water, I spread myself out like a flying squirrel and I am stopped 
almost dead. I guarantee you if this was six feet deep, I could have had this done. It just is how it is. I have dived into some of the tiniest little pools where you're just, you know, three to four feet of water. And yes, it is dangerous and all of that. But you know, everything I do is calculated. And I'm glad you're here for the ride. Always score the ad shot. Let me know what you think in the comments below. There's more to come. Please, subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.